Amen. So what is your view on uh, financing the Olympic team so participants don't have to scramble for funds? You know, and maybe you can talk about the impact of not having funds. I mean, you, you sort of kind of a little bit talked about it. You know, how does this really affect you guys? I think we should change the approach of financing the Olympics and everything. The Olympics are not being financed. They're being prepared for platforms that are being put in place. You don't wait and then six months you put a million, you put three million down, you say you finance it. It's not going to work. It's not going to be an investment because if you look at the Olympics, something that people invest in eight years ahead, 10 years ahead, that's why we look at athletes and say, no, this athlete has been working for this 10 years and to get to this medal for them. You know, it's something that needs to be invested. We should look at the Olympics as a long-term investment, not a short-term financing kind of setup. You know, so um, I, I was hoping I could went back and say, okay, the next Olympics, not even the next, the next after before that, what do we do? Who, who do we have in the table? What are we doing for those people to make sure that when time comes, they're really delivering that? This time, this thing of us waiting until two months down the line and you know, put your money on the table, it's really not going to help at the end of the day. It's not going to change anything. It's still the same as nothing was put in the table, you know.